everybody, and if this... No, is- welcome everyone to the Men of Doozy Party Podcast. Yeah! Good week, party. And if this... And if any of you party girls or party boys, this is your first time tuning in, hey. you're probably thinking, men of doozy, what does huh? that even mean? Well, the word doozy means something that is extraordinary or outstanding of its kind, ladies and gentlemen. And we are not that. But oh, do we want to be. Oh, boy, that's right. And so this is the podcast that we are going to give you the tools that you need to help you become successful in life. And the best part is, we're huh? going to learn how to be successful in life ourselves, while we are also teaching you how to be successful in life. And carry the two, and carry the one, and, and, carry, and, and carry, make sense divided to by me. Three. I'm Alex Stubb. <laughs> and I am Kurt Cos. Welcome, everybody. Kurt, what are we talking about today? I am so excited for this topic, Look at that Alex. little party hat. Look at this little, <laughs> look at look this little, 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 little guy. Look at this I guy. love it. Dude, I got my party shirt I think it was for my on. cat, but... But, that's, but, that, that may, but it fits. It's I'm great. I'm a little minx. I love it. So I, uh, we are going to learn mm. how to throw a party. Oh. Yo, we got our party hats, bring, 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 our party bring, bring, shirts, bring. our party <laughs> shades. <laughs> I'm ready, dude. I'm ready. I'm so Let's ready. Jump, let, me, let me ask you a question. Yeah. Have you ever had thrown a party before? I have. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Great. How about you? Have you thrown a party? I have, yeah. Yes. Oh, oh, delightful. We've all thrown a party. uh, So, but let's just let's just jump in. I'm I'm so amped up and ready. And then and then at the end we'll say, if we've had like a party like this, if it's been this like perfect. But we're gonna throw you how to. We're gonna tell you. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna suffer and suck a bitch. I'm just so excited. (laughs) We are, we're going to teach you how to throw a party, okay? The top ten tips. If you're going to host a party, party you're going to throw one. You're like, this is my time to shine. I'm going to throw a party. I'm going to finally be the cool kid. It's around yeah. the holidays. Hopefully, you yeah. will be able to safely be seeing people um, right now. Yes. And seeing friends or family and stuff. And you want to be prepared. So yeah. let's jump in. Let's just jump in. The mm. top ten tip how to throw a party. Plan the music. Mm. Arrange it so that you won't be distracted from being a good host or hostess by the need to tend to the music. Putting your iPod on shuffle just means something embarrassing like the Oklahoma soundtrack will start playing or worse. Oh, Oklahoma. Oklahoma. Anyways, uh, or someone could steal your iPod. Right, it goes from Kanye to Oklahoma soundtrack. They're like, what? They're what like, is, what the? I am so here? confused. Yeah. Unless it's a show tune themed yeah. party, right? Which you'd know yeah. really, really quickly if you were surrounded by exactly. a bunch of MT people. Exactly. So, um, so set up the music that keeps it pumping and that no one will be walking away with. Wireless speakers are a good investment if you don't already have them. Design a playlist now. Of all songs that meet your party needs. Pause and do that right now. No, we're just mm. kidding. Make sure the playlist is long enough so repeating will go unnoticed. When the party rolls around, you hit play and your DJing job is done. I have to say, dude. I, dude, come on. Don't I? I'm like the I was, master that, at the dude, Bluetooth Bro, uh, that's exactly yeah. what I was going to say. You have incredible Bluetooth speakers, great sound quality. Also, you have a nice different array. Whenever I'm, um, I'm hanging out with you and we get... Like I just feel like the a vibe. party. I, I, There's I, a I vibe, know how to DJ the playlist, and you said yeah. it. And you know what? You know what? This also reminds me of. If you have music, then it's and it's good music. It's matching the vibe. If you can get people to get out of their comfort zone and maybe groove a I little always, bit, I know how to dance. do it. I always know how to. Do it, you yeah. do, and this is a quick story. It um, a few months back, mm. both you and I mm. were at a party. Yeah, and I was going hard on the dance floor, okay? Yeah, okay? And a stranger came up to me and said, you're like a nutter butter on the dance floor. A nutter butter? A nutter butter. And I said, a nutter butter? What does that mean? And she said, it's because you're sweet and delicious on the dance floor. And I <laughs> don't ever not think about that every single sweet second of every day. Sweet and delicious on the dance Sweet and floor. delicious. So, you, but you know you're what nu- it was? You're, you're I'm a nutter butter. You're a nutter butter. The men of, du- the, the men of doozy Even are... outside the dance floor, you're a nutter butter. Uh, I mean, yeah, yeah. Sweet but and delicious. Our, our viewers haven't necessarily right seen me. Right now, you're going to Hershey's Kiss. <laughs> 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 Basically, I'm looking for the jelly donut to my nutter butter. So, ladies, slide in those DMs. I'll show you some moves. 
um, the <laughs> dance floor? Yes. I promise you. No, but you know what happened? He's a nutter butter no matter where he goes. No matter where I go. But I got that compliment because I was grooving in the music. The first thing was the music. Yeah. The music was so... You got, you got good dance moves. Thank you. Yeah. You... Yeah, I can, you can I, take can, I can groove. You can I groove. Can, I can groove. It's like the hitch yeah. step. I, I step. You got that. Down I got the step step. <laughs> and, <then laughs> step, I, step. Uh, and then it's like, yeah. whoa. Mm, oh, mm, the, mm. throwing a little bit I of torso. Still, I, I, can still, I, I can still dance with the rhythm. I still I still got the beat You know what? There. All you need is rhythm. Now, the, we're, yeah. we're, we're getting on a different topic about just dancing in general. All right, well, let's stay on topic music. here. Music. Music. Moving on. Set your music. Number nine, decorate. Yeah, okay. This could be as simple as throwing a tablecloth. And waiting for the potluck dishes to show up or as extravagant as lining the entire room in glitter snowflakes, wow. making the fake snow, and turning the AC on high. Luckily, there's no wrong way to go about it. Decorate your place. You throw in a party, add a little, add a little something to the add atmosphere. Add a little, little, little flair. Add a little, little pizzazz. Yeah, add a little something so you know that it's so you're, people you're know. in the party zone. You know what I'm saying? Because if you're put up some streamers, put up a little something, something, put a disco ball in there or something. Yeah, and like decorate a little just, bit. Yeah, yeah, be a little specific. Use tablecloths. No, know, yeah. know what they're going into. Like, don't have a bunch of like cowboys or like oklahoma posters and kanye posters yeah, exactly. you know because yeah. they'll immediately be like oh, who am i i don't think i want to be here yeah. anymore <laughs> oh, oh yeah or, or if you throw glitter snowflakes everywhere make fake snow and turn the ac up on high but the theme is like summertime like you don't you just yeah. know how to decorate the room understand what you're even throwing whether yeah, exactly. it's a birthday party yeah, dec- yeah. decorate the room and Set i the music and godspeed if you really decorate well because you're gonna have a big cleaning job i'm not like the mm. biggest decorator but it's good to know you know it's yeah it's, decorate you know yeah yeah number Boom. eight Plan your setup. Woo. Your home probably isn't ideally set up for a party yet. You want easy access to the bathroom, the food and drinks from just about anywhere, and loads of lounging space. So where will everything be? Do you have enough chairs? How about the music? Oh, we're already, we already got the music on deck. Make sure everything you don't want messed with doesn't get messed with if you're in a location that has important or necessary items. Mm. Designate a Catch all space for all things that your go- guests almost said ghosts. Your guests, if your if your guests are ghosts, yeah, if your guests are ghosts, you're yeah. having a I'm having a party. seance. Yeah, I'm having exactly. a seance party. Yeah, exactly. Um, your guests, uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Designate a, a, a catch all space for all things that your guests are not welcome to get near. Breakable goods, antiques, and valuables. This is yeah. really important. Yeah. We all have have yeah. really um, have the party room, and then all like the expensive stuff. Put it in a separate room yeah. where, no one, where you know no one's going to go into. We all you have know, create uh, the party things. zone. Yeah. Plan, yeah, plan the setup of the house. Yeah, now, now don't like put a caution so- like signs right. like a police thing because yeah. that'll be confusing unless it's a yeah. police right. and and uh, police yeah. party. I don't, don't put the fine china next to the punch bowl. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Don't yeah. don't do it because someone's going to go into that table. Somebody's going to like drink from the like china china tea. Teapot. Exactly, and it's just like no, that's not meant for this jungle juice. Exactly. Don't if you if you have fine china, you know, uh, who any are you? kind of glassware. <laughs> if you are, uh, you know, a hemophiliac, don't like, you know, go <laughs> places where you, sh- you know the party's gonna turn up. Yeah, be be smart and protect your expensive belongings. Simple. Simple. Let's do it. Moving on. Number seven, consider personalized items, okay? Mm. If you have a small guest list and know exactly who is coming, consider having a few personalized items to make them feel special and to remember the party. It can be simply a specially decorated cupcake, (laughs) a table centerpiece, a favorite dish, or a glass that's all their own, right? Make it personal. Because if you got friends come in, you're like, ooh, they love this type of vodka. Yeah. Right? And then they show up and they're like, oh, you got the vodka at this party. I will remember forever. Or, or even like we, we've touched on the music. If you know. Yeah, if you a know few of your friends like, get yeah. lit over yeah. certain music. If you know you, half of your friends it. like Kanye and the other half like Oklahoma, you need to make two different rooms. <laughs> yeah, first off, <laughs> you need to have make two different rooms. You have rooms. to inception uh, yes, your yes, your own yes. party and have yeah. multiple <laughs> rooms yeah. of parties. Make one people make, make one half of the party they go in from the front of the house, the other people go in from the back of the house. Yeah. 
and then you got show tunes in one, and then you got, uh, you know, hip hop in the in the other one. Exactly. Oh my God! Exactly. Yeah. Make it personal. Is... Make it personal. Make it personal. Number six. Number six. Drunk proof your location. Mm. We're not going to beat around the bush here. If you're having a party with alcohol, kid proof everything. Yes. And let's be honest, a lot of adults out there are like kids. Yeah. So you gotta you gotta dumb it down. You'll regret not doing so way before morning when it rears its ugly head. Get, <gasps> get the pillows and Advil ready and have the carpet cleaner on standby. Because because George, your friend from college, is going to yak exactly. all over your, I'm your sorry. China. I'm Yanked sorry. The China. You got my favorite and vodka. I punched your hemophiliac baby. <laughs> what? I don't have a baby. Who's baby? Who's baby? Who's baby? Who's baby? <laughs> um, if it's your party, it's your party, guys. So you are responsible. And you can for... cry when you want to. <laughs> so you're responsible for the guests. It's like having children. If drunk driving is an issue, ooh, mm. take their keys when they arrive. Mm. That's really important. Hide them and only give them back when they're sober enough to drive. You're not being a square. You're saving your butt if something were to go wrong. That's yeah. really smart. Smart. That's really smart. Drunk proof. Drunk you know, proof the party. Because you, you know, know it's going to get crazy. Absolutely. Especially on the Oklahoma side of things. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, hold on. <laughs> the hip-hop side, they're not too crazy, but with the show tunes. I mean, the house, the, yo, yo. Down the I wall went paper. to college with them. They're insane. Insane. Um, yeah. Take care, of, take care of your party guests if they get too drunk. You, you really got to be safe, especially in big cities. And if you have a car in a big city or even s- suburban, you know, it. Yeah, you don't want people drinking. You don't driving. want people you want driving. To have fun. Like, yeah. I know it's probably yeah, not going to. Pillows gonna, in the Advil, right? Yeah, I, I know it's probably not. It didn't really go in depth, but that's pillows in Advil. That's saying, hey, you might have to deal with somebody crashing, you know, yeah. at your place. And you just like, that's what comes with throwing a party. Be prepped for that. And also drunk proof it. Yeah. Drunk proof it. Drunk proof it. And if you yourself are too drunk, you know, bad host. Bad. bad no, host. I mean, bad yeah, host. No, yeah. take your but own, hide your own keys from yourself. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Give them to your to your friend George. Yeah. 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 You take his keys. He takes your keys. You both drive different cars. <laughs> Great. Moving on, guys. We're Number in the top five. five. Don't forget to plan cleanup. Mm, clean up. What's clean worse? up. Everybody do their share. That's right. It's all, it all makes sense now. Yeah, with the Advil. And the, yeah. What's worse than a great party and a huge... What's worse than a great party uh-huh. and a huge mess to clean up afterwards? Uh-huh. A good party and a huge mess to clean up afterwards with no cleaning supplies. Uh-oh. So when you're buying your cream cheese and vodka... What take the a, fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? Fuck. Take a gander through the cleaning section. You'll need some paper towels, some garbage bags, some sponges, and some cleaning spray if you don't already have these. Oh, uh, do you mind? I like to dip my cream cheese in my vodka. <laughs> you have cream <laughs> cheese flavored vodka? Excuse me? Uh, did I stutter? No, what type of cream cheese do you, do you have? We have, we oh, have Philadelphia. a strawberry at Philadelphia. Great, okay, yeah. Whipped. Absolutely. Whipped. <laughs> Veggies? Wh- whipped veggie Philadelphia whipped cream veggie. cheese and vodka. What the hell? Disgusting. That That's disgusting. I, I got cream cheese. What do I need for this party? I got vodka. Is it, is it a cream cream cheese need, is it a cream cheese party? Is it a cheese party? It's just a giant bowl of cream cheese. And spoons. <laughs> and spoons. There's and no spoons. bread. This came from an article. This is, but, Yo, you know what I'm saying? So we vetted this. People just um, spoon cream cheese and a shot of there's, vodka. There's, there's cream cheese, vodka, and nutter butters. That's what it. the hell? This is the, and that's on the Oklahoma side of things. <laughs> but, but I mean, at least the music is what good. What do people in Oklahoma eat? Cream cheese? Cream cheese? <laughs> Why is God. that old woman churning butter in yeah, the corner? Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> get get make sure you have cleaning this supplies is important to clean up the party. Because if you wake up and you're hungover, you don't want to have to go out to the store and get them. While you're at the store getting all your party supplies, get the cleaning supplies as well. Smart. That's so. And you know what? I would Smart. I would go far to say have some people that that you can rely on to maybe to help you to help you, help you, yeah. you clean help, up, especially yeah. if it's gonna end like 
a little bit later in the night, or if you're gonna, if you know somebody, guilt trip them. Yeah, guilt trip them. Just be like, listen, hey. George, you can't have any of this vodka. Yeah, that this cream trip. cheese vodka. And, just, unless... and, just be, and George is like, it wakes up the next morning. Hey, great party. Uh, I'll see ya. And I'm like, well, it'd be a shame if I had to clean up all of this by myself. And your wife found out that you hooked up with a girl in the bathroom. And he'd be like, oh, well. Oh, please, please. Well, let me clean up this and let me clean this up and then have your friends do the cleanup for you. Please, please, don't, please don't tell her how many oh, spoonfuls of cream cheese I had were vegan. You had, you've had <laughs> lots of cream cheese last night, George. <laughs> Moving right. on. Yeah. Number four. Um, set the time, date, and place. Mm. Plan at least three months out so that you have ample time for publicity and to create a large email invite guest list. Okay, a little dated. Give your guests a six-week save the date email and make sure formal invites via mail or email are dated no less than two weeks out. This gives your guests ample notice and gives you time to prepare for the party of the year. It depends on the party. But, you know, sending out, yeah. sending out an email or, like, a big text and stuff like that or go on the social media. If you if if you set a date in advance and you're like, this is going to be the party of the year, you have people have time to go in, go out, change their plans, like, figure yeah. things out. And, like, you could, you could amass a big group of people the, the more farther out it is. And you, you know? know what? If you're not setting a time, date, or place in advance, right. and then people are going in and out, and they're like, oh, just stop and buy, and you get, like, frustrated – well, that's that's on you. You right. should have uh, prepped and planned yeah, a little prepped. bit more. Yeah, it's it's you know? don't go out buy the whole all the party supplies, set up the whole party, and then at like eight o'clock at night, be like, "Hey, party at my place." No one's coming, and if they do, it's your mom yeah. to ask how much money you spent on the cream cheese. Cream cheese. <laughs> I had to ask where all your cream <laughs> cheese. <laughs> Um, Alex, Alex, Mom, you just, uh, uh, where does my cream the cheese go? She's like, party guys. It's just you sitting there with all your cream cheese listening to Oklahoma. <laughs> and, and your mom's like, Alex, where's all my cream cheese? And you're like, oh, shit. Oh, no. No. I'm having a bagel party and tomorrow, Alex. That? And who's this woman churning butter? <laughs> exactly. Set a date, set, set a date and be like, yo, the party's this Saturday. Let's yo. get crazy. Gonna right? have this, this, So then this. people will be like, oh, it's Saturday, Saturday. The party's Saturday. Oh, yeah. Oh, yo, this person's gonna be yeah. here. This person, yeah. All right, we're in the top three, Top three, three babies. Now. Top Let's three. Pick a theme. Number three. I like this. I Pick like a this theme. a lot. Yeah. Avoid 80s or white trash trailer bash if you can. <laughs> Those are parties you guys probably went to last week. So glad I haven't. How about a cartoon theme, huh? Or a theme around your favorite TV show, okay. huh? Or a movie, huh? huh? A location, huh? huh? A specific food, huh? A concept or a season work too. You know, I yeah. saw, yeah, yeah, I yeah. saw one theme that I thought was really cool. It was anything but a cup party. Yo, those look and so were, like, cool. I've never been to one out of those. Like, uh, like uh, you know, laundry detergent things and and uh, yeah, or or even know, oh my god, like watering cans and stuff like that. And oh yeah, yeah, laundry detergent, freaking yeah. oh. Those are the coolest, yeah. coolest parties. Yeah. Boots. Like, like, like pans that you would like. Yeah, pans. Like, yeah. just like a huge pan yeah. you're drinking out of, like, that you would cook with. Yeah. That's that's kind of fun. Someone had, like, a, I saw, like, a gasoline-like canister <laughs> or whatever. <laughs> yeah. It's like, I really hope that they watch that This alcohol out. tastes weird. That's because it's gasoline, that's George. The, that's a, <laughs> my favorite. <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> yeah, pick a theme. Pick it a helps theme. you. It would be more fun. People would come, showed up. Showing up. Well, obviously, and all, obviously, pick a theme is only going to help with all the, the recent tips. It's going to help yeah. you with the date and time. Yeah. It's going to help you with how, uh, to, how to decorate. How to decorate. Yeah. And how like to play the, the music. music. The music. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. All right. Number two, two everybody. Number two. Keep the guests entertained and mingling. Mm. This should only be, only partly be your job. You should be having fun, too. You might think of assigning this to particularly bubbly or extroverted attendees in advance. Give them a simple list of communication ideas. Maybe a different colored wristband, glass, or a name tag. 
Okay, that's weird. Uh, but do keep an eye on the feel <laughs> of the room. Does the music need to be changed? Is is it a little bit too much Oklahoma? You need a little Kanye. Right. Has anything run out? Right. Have you ran out of the cream cheese vodka? <laughs> Are you done with the cream Are cheese? Are you done with the cream cheese? Because that goes quick. Maybe you should have. You shouldn't have forgot the bagels that goes in the first fast. place. Fast. Are people <laughs> mingling appropriately? Mix them up and get them talking if you have to. Did people from the hip hop room wander into the Oklahoma room Whoops. looking for the bathroom? Let's Let's hope they get what the hell is going on in here? <laughs> Yo, that chick over there, you see that chick churning is that butter? Girl churning butter? She's hot. <laughs> um Alex, what she's is 78 tr- years what old. What is this cream cheese? <laughs> In the vodka? But no, yeah, yeah. Mix it up and get, get new people talking. Make new sure people, everyone's having fun. Yeah, new people may need a nudge in the right direction. A good host is able to mingle, still have a good time, keep eyes on the um, – yeah. uh, make sure everyone's safe. Feel the vibe of the, the room. Vibe. Yeah. Uh, keep eyes on the music. Yeah, yeah this is important. Yes. You want to make sure that everyone is having a good time. Yeah. And I think, I think for me personally – Sometimes you just have to get out, of, go out of your way to really, like, talk to people that you necessarily wouldn't talk to. Or how about that cream cheese, huh? <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> how about that cream cheese? Make everyone, make sure everyone's having fun. All right, yeah. we've made it to the we've number one it. tip, everybody. Blah, 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 blah. This is the number one tip, the top tip on how to throw a party. Alex, take it away. Number one, know when to call it quits. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and that just doesn't mean cheese cream cheese consumption, okay? <laughs> a party can be raring for hours, but you have to know when to start suggesting people to head for the to tell people to head to the exit. Yes. If it's 2 a.m. and you have to clean up a pile of red solo cups the Egyptians would be proud of, don't feel <laughs> embarrassed to start rounding them up like cattle, okay? It's a weird reference. Yeah. It's been fun. It's been real, but party time is over, folks. It's time to call it a day. Yeah, have respect no one to stop. for yourself. No one to stop. Okay, the respect for your party. No one, no one to stop. It, when you when you've eaten an entire thing of cream cheese, I, all I, the let vodka, me tell you. and when the Oklahoma is starting to sound like the Kanye music, <laughs> it it. it you, this is when you need to be, and, and people are like either passed out on the floor, throwing up, or dead. You need to like or joining the lady to, or to join or churning, or, or butter. churning it's, it's, butter, but it's not, you know, it's not, it's not, you know, a safe space. It's anymore. not a safe space <laughs> anymore. <laughs> then get everyone out of there, okay? Call it quits, call it a night. You know, you need to know when to say, you know what, yeah, I'm gonna get to go home now. Yeah, yeah, I think I think I need people. I to think leave. I'm done. You, you know, I think it's also just like a no one to stop partying. No one to stop partying for sure. Also, if you're following all these tips and hitting them hard and and really meeting the challenge, this is the biggest challenge that people might be having such yeah. a great time that oh, I'll, you might I'll have run to... myself right into the ground. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I don't know when to stop. Yeah, you know, or like you go to stop and everyone's like, "I got another cake." No! And George is like, well, we're out of cream cheese. And then <laughs> Becky shows up and she's like, I got more cream cheese! They were sold out. We, we bought all the cream cheese in the, uh, around the state, so we had to cross the border to go get some more cream cheese. We had to literally go to Philadelphia Wait a second. For, for cream cheese. Phil, were you driving? Uh, absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. No, the no, butter no. churning lady. The butter churning She was like, I've never, I've never... Driven this yeah, horse and yeah, It was on a horse and buggy. <laughs> she was like, let's yeah. take my horse and buggy. Let's take the horse. Take my, take the reins. I'm too drunk. <laughs> George, can you turn the butter while I take these fun people to Five people down, <laughs> to, down, Philadelphia down to Philadelphia to get some cream cheese. Whipped cream cheese. Whipped cream cheese. <laughs> be more like. I can't believe it's not butter. Be more like Tabitha the the butter churning lady. Definitely Tabitha. <laughs> well, those are the top 10 that tips, was everybody. It. We're, we're out of time, unfortunately. We are. We know when to call it quits. We, we really do. I think we've yeah. t- we've exhausted the cream we've cheese exhausted joke. exhausted the cream cheese joke. 
I'm never eating cream cheese <laughs> again. I'll tell you that. I have a half of a bagel to finish. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I don't know if I am. Exactly. I'm up for the task. Yeah. And I'm dating Tabitha now. So <laughs> thank you, everyone, for watching the Men of Doozy podcast. Yes, thank you, guys. And please, let us know. Comment what your favorite tip was on how to throw a party. And if you have a tip that helps you specifically to throw a party, send us a comment. Share with friends. Where are we available? Share it. Subscribe Ooh. to YouTube, Spotify, mm. Mm. Uh, mm. Apple Podcasts. Go go on Instagram. That's where all the fun is. That's where go the fun is. Go to Instagram and follow us on the gram, right? Well, you 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 uh, tag us in anything. We'll we'll be sure to we'll repost we'll, you. We'll, we'll, we'll engage repost engage you. with we're, us. Yeah, engage with us. We're, we're here. The greatest thing that that helps us, us a party. build and laugh and learn and get better is for you guys to engage. Yeah. So if there is something that you want to learn and have us teach you while we also learn about it, let us know. Makes hey, sense to me. Yeah, that's what it sounds <laughs> like. I was like, like oh. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, keep Makes churning your me. butter. Churn your butter. Eat your cream cheese. Eat your cream cheese vodka. Take the keys stay, away from your friends. And stay safe. Stay safe. And no, no alcohol. <laughs> I was going to say Oklahoma, but I think <laughs> Episode, everybody. Love